Hey there, it's Alexis. I'm the crafter behind Persialoo.com and I have a fun new project to share with you guys today. We are going to be making these stained glass inspired butterfly window clings. Did you know you can make your own window clings? It's true and they are so easy to make and I'm gonna show you how to walk you through the whole process. So the secret ingredient to making your own beautiful window clings is this stuff. Liquid Sculpey, which is a liquid polymer clay. This video and this project are made in partnership with Sculpey. I love working with Sculpey products, and this project is definitely no exception. I love how these butterfly window clings turned out, and I can't wait to show you how I made them. So let's go get started. All right, so I have some butterfly coloring pages here. These are available for free to download over on my website, and you can find the link down below in the description. I'm gonna go with this one, and then I have a piece of eight by 10 glass that I'm putting on top of it. This is just like replacement glass for a picture frame. I'm gonna start by doing the outline, and for the outline, I'm going to be using black liquid Sculpey. So first, be sure to stir it up real good and make sure it's all really well mixed. And then you're going to use your liquid Sculpey to trace that black outline. The technique that worked the best for me to get a nice clean line is to kind of let the liquid Sculpey fall onto the glass and then pull it in the direction you want to go instead of pressing it down onto the glass. If you've ever decorated cookies or worked with royal icing, it's a similar technique you would use for that. Then you wanna go in with a needle or some other sharp little tool and pop any bubbles that you have in your liquid Sculpey. If you bake it with the bubbles, the bubbles will bake in. Now we're ready to bake. So I'm gonna pull my glass sheet and we're just going to bake according to the instructions, which for the black liquid Sculpey is 15 minutes for thicknesses under a quarter inch in a 275 degree oven. Okay, so here's what the outline looks like after baking and we are ready to fill in those beautiful butterfly wings. I'm going to start with some clear liquid Sculpey and I'm just going to put a little bit into each of the panels of the butterfly wing. Then I'm going to add in some of the new multi-chromatic purple liquid Sculpey, which is really beautiful. I'm going to add just a little bit to each of the sections again. I don't want to fill them completely because I'm going to spread them out and I don't want them overflowing over the outlines that I've already baked. Then I'm going to take my stir stick and I'm going to use it to spread out the clear liquid Sculpey and the multi-chromatic purple to fill in the panels and then I'm going to swirl the two together to create this beautiful marbled look. And cotton swabs work perfectly for cleaning up any little messes. And when all the sections of your butterfly wings are filled in and swirled, you are ready to bake again. The baking instructions for clear liquid Sculpey are 15 minutes for thicknesses under a quarter inch in a 300 degree oven. After baking and cooling, carefully peel your butterfly window cling off of your sheet of glass and you can really see that beautiful multi-chromatic purple sparkle. I love how it mixes with the clear to create this beautiful sun catcher stained glass effect. I wanna show you a few other techniques you can use when making your own butterfly window clings. So I have the Sculpey silicone mixing set here, which is perfect for creating your own colors and variations of liquid Sculpey. So I'm gonna start off by pouring some black liquid Sculpey into my mixing cup and then getting a scoop of copper mica powder and just stirring that in really well, making sure it's thoroughly mixed. And this will just give my frame for my butterfly a slightly metallic effect that I really like. And then the mixing cup is perfect to pour back into your bottle because it's nice and flexible. And then I am ready to do my outline with my metallic-y black liquid Sculpey. The rest of the process for this butterfly is really similar to what I did with the first one. I put a little bit of clear liquid Sculpey and a little bit of the multi-chromatic purple into each section of the butterfly and swirled them together. But with this one, I decided to add something a little extra, so I took some silver flaky glitter and my stir stick and I just kind of added a few flakes of sparkly glitter to each section of the butterfly wings. 
And just like before, I baked this one according to the instructions. When it's all done, peel it off and it's ready to decorate your window. All right, that's it for today. I hope that you enjoyed this video and that there will be some window cling making in your future. Until next time, happy making. Bye.